Hello everybody, I am finally back again. Don't mind the way that I look, I just kind of woke up and I woke up to a notification that my package has been delivered. So, um, I got up and I picked it up. Um, my voice probably sounds different because I might be getting, coming down with something. I woke up a couple times. Right now it's like just before noon. I woke up at 5.30 and I couldn't breathe out of my mouth, which was not fun. So I took some Mucinex and then I woke up around 7.30 and I kept breathing again, which was great. And then I've just been slowly, you know, just living. Um, today I have a whole bunch of stuff to do. Like a lot. I have, and then now I have to do some writing analysis for an assessment course, I have to read and do reflections. I need to do my final for my one class, which is online. I think it's like four or five questions, so it's not really like too much, but I still need to get that done. And I have a big project due tomorrow at nine, which I haven't started the writing portion, so I have to do that. So a lot of stuff on my plate. I haven't even showered yet. I always take a shower in the morning, but like you can see, like I have like bed head. I also got a haircut, but you'll still get, see that in my next video. Yes, I'm promising that there's going to be another video sometime in the week, I'm hoping. Not like this week, but like a week. So maybe on Thursday. It'll have to do with what's inside of here. <coughs> I am so sorry. So, oh, I'll just tell you what the next video will probably be. The next video will probably be a an updated sunglass collection. Because I have just been going crazy with sunglasses right now. Sorry, I'm like on like this plank board. <laughs> anyway, um, I've been going kind of sunglass crazy. I've bought, I've bought, I bought five, six pairs within the last since like September. So I need to kind of work on that. But anyway, this weekend I saw this pair online and this is not something that I was planning on buying. However, it's something that I saw and the price I just cannot be. So, without uh, further ado, this is the huge box for what's actually inside of it. But let's open it up. I took off all of the shipping, shipping packaging, um, as one does, so then that way you don't know where I live. These are my favorite scissors. It, um, I don't know if they make them anymore. These were a Nate Burkus um, collaboration with Target. Um, and these are actually, I'm not sure if these are, have a brand on them. But they do have that, which I'm not sure if that's a brand for something. I also have the stapler, which is Swing Line. I believe that's a brand. Okay. So open it up, and I have some bubble wrap. I hate being on this thing, it makes all this noise. I might be able to use this for some Christmas wrapping. I have here my receipt. Let me just see. I don't want to show what it is, but I can show you the price. I'm going to cover up the barcodes just in case. Actually, I'll show, I'll show you this afterwards. I, so, this is a brand that I never thought that I would buy again. So yes, it's something that I already have in my collection. Um, it is this little silver box. So... I have a pair of Ray-Bans. Actually, let me go get that for you. So, I already have a pair of Ray-Bans. This is them. I, I'm pretty sure I've said this before. These are the one pair of sunglasses that I wouldn't, like, I would sell if I could. But, I actually have my initials engraved on the outside and it has my name on the inside of each. And it's a custom, like, I was able to pick um, the tortoise shell with the beige inside, tortoise shell with the beige inside. So, it's a very custom piece. Um, 
even the case. I liked it in red. And I have more issues than Vogue. And the reason why it's spaced out like that is because for some reason they would not let me write Vogue as one word. But if you space it out, then you can. So this was this is my first pair of Ray-Bans and I said that I was trying to get another pair because I just never wore them. However, there was this, there has been this one pair that whenever I saw in store, I would try on. And the price was always just like a regular price. I'm not even sure what the retail price was. I think it was 210, 215 is the retail price. Let's see if it's sticky. Oh, and also I wanted to show you, sorry, anticipation. So I do have this other case. I have this case from, um, I got a pair of sunglasses that I still don't think I've shown you yet, but it did not come with a pair, with a, um, it did not come with a case. So I went back to, I ordered it from Nordstrom Rack, and I, so I went into the store, and I told them, and they just gave me this one. So this is, a, if you compare it to this one, this is a lot bigger than this one. This also has the belt loop. So I did, and with it, it came with this, the case and a little care card. So I had this as an extra. I also have a Balm um, case as extra. Let's get into it. Okay, so this one, this one is the same size as this one, it's look, it looks like. And this looks like it's plastic on the little end. This is, this is supposed to be fake leather. It's not real leather at all. So, ready? Woohoo. So, the reason... Okay, so this is not what I thought it was. I thought it was darker, however, and it's also last sale. But I actually like this better than what I thought it was. Look at these. They're denim sunglasses. How cool. Now, I'm not sure if these are the same size as the ones. Let's see. Let's investigate. Are these the same size? These look to be a different shape. Trying to do this. Are these a different shape? I feel like these are just the. Yeah, these are a little bit taller. Okay, cool. <clears throat> I apologize. So this says Denim Wayfarer. Um, the style code is RB, which is Ray Ban, 2140. Uh, made in Italy, handmade in Italy. But like, if you look on the side, you'll see this is like actual denim. Like, it, it's denim all the way throughout and it has these little and it still has nose pads the i'm trying to figure out what color this is like a i would say this is a gray gray tint but oh my god i actually love these so let me i'm just gonna pull up on my phone um like a screenshot of the image so the screenshot made it look like these were very dark wash denim um but the, this pair would actually go with a lot more of my denim. Like, I'm actually wearing, um, I'm actually wearing some denim right now. Let's see. This is go pretty well. This is a lighter wash than I thought it would be. So, price. Um, it does not say, it does, doesn't have the original tags on here. Um, so let's see. Oh, and inside of this, you have the, ooh, oh, ooh. So you have the, um, care booklet. Oh, and then these I have not seen before. This is what this is, the icons. So it has all of the different ones. There's the Wayfair. This is my first pair of, yes, that these are different because this is the Wayfarer. These are the new Wayfarer, and honestly, I like these better than these. These are just a little bit smaller. These are sportier. Um, these feel like more casual. I'm gonna keep these on for now. <laughs> um, 
Caravan on Bia Balabora, Clubmast Balabora. Did I just. Balorama. Look at these. I haven't seen some of these before. But I'm not too into revans. But look, there's a little one from Denim. Let's read it. This is Denim Wayfair. And look, they're all. So these also come in like, um, like I've seen like a more of a turquoise color they have. Um, they've had purple, they have black, um, but I like this. This is just the true demo. So let's see what it says. Congratulations on your new purchase. A strong, cool look distinguishes the new Wayfarer from, for the first time, clad in denim. The material that has inspired scores of film, fashion, music, and art celebrities is now a star in the world of eyewear. Each pair is made through an exclusive, high-tech manufacturing process, whereby several layers of very thick woven, 100% Italian denim are pressed at a temperature of just under 200 degrees Celsius. So, not Fahrenheit, Celsius, so that's very hot. The finishes are entirely handmade finishes, so... Not exactly sure what that means. Okay. Maintenance. Do not dip any part of these glasses in any type of liquid. So these should not become wet. That's what they're telling me, which I will not do. For cleaning, use a soft, dry cloth moistened with water and mild detergent if necessary. Then dab the surface gently. Do not use products that may cause allergic reactions. Avoid contact with alcohol and chemically aggressive solutions. And it just, again, shows all these pictures. And then it says, over time, you may notice a natural fading of color loss on your glasses. These are not defects, but distinctive features of the fabric used and characterize your model just like they do your favorite jeans. And then it just says that in other languages. So that's actually really cool. <clears throat> so I like um, some glasses that are made in different materials. This is only my second pair that's made in a material that's not the most normal. Um, so denim. Uh, this is actually probably the most abstract one. The other pair is... Um, my Chanel sunglasses have leather on the side. Um, and I'll get more into that on the sunglass video. And I'm not sure if I have a, sun uh, if I have a Chanel sunglass um, video, but I would like to make one of those. So, these I enjoyed a, enjoy a lot more than these, for sure. I am definitely going to wear these, just not in the rain. And yes, I do wear sunglasses in the rain, so I need to remind myself not to wear these in the rain. Um, where's it going to go with this? Pricing. So, I, I'm 99% sure it's, it's two fifteen was the um, retail price. I got them for... $52.48. So, I've seen them a lot of places for $115.99, and I think before I've seen them for $80 or $90. But on, I got these from Saks off Fifth, and they were $69, but then they had an additional 25% off. So, I was able to get them for a lot less, and I have, I don't know how, but I have, um, Shop Runner, which you can get free two-day shipping, and so I ordered that, when did I order those? I ordered those on the 8th, so Saturday, yeah, Saturday, like, like late Saturday, so, and, I, and today is a Tuesday, so this is definitely two-day shipping, well, yeah, two-day shipping, because Monday, Tuesday. So, because they don't work on Sundays. So, thank you all for watching. I am so sorry for this long break of content. Um, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe. Um, I definitely want to be doing more videos. Um, and my next video is most likely going to be a sunglass video because I love sunglasses. So, and again, I'm sorry for my voice. Hopefully by then I'll be done. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching me unbox my new sunglasses. Um, have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye.